Oh, what? Oh, what? What? Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Thousand One Games. I'm your host, Gaming J, and today we're hopping into the Age Tech Classic, known as Fire Pro Wrestling Returns. This is a wrestling game for the PlayStation 2. Now, it came out in 2005 in Japan and 2007 in North America, which I guess North Americans had to wait longer for the Fire Pro Wrestling to return. Uh, but why? Why? Like, were they not confident that a wrestling game with predominantly white dudes would not do well in North America? So they decided to, like, test market it in Japan for two years? Until they were like, alright, we're, we're satisfied, this thing will fly in North America. You know, like, of all the games to, like, hold in Japan for two extra years. Wrestling? Um, okay. So it came out in 2007 in North America, and then 2008 they released it to the remaining territories of Italy, Spain, and Portugal. So yeah, I guess this is technically an international release, I don't know. I don't, if you live outside of those countries, maybe you've seen this game, maybe not. I've never heard of this game before, but I'm actually super excited by it, and you're going to see why in just a moment. So this is a PlayStation 2 game, and so you might imagine, all right, we're going to see some polygonal wrestlers. There may be no-name no dollar store generic brand knockoffs of, uh, you know, the big ducks like uh, Hulk Hogan and uh, Macho Man Randy Savage. But in fact, um, there's a little bit more to it than just that. So let's start with an exhibition match here. We're going to do a... Oh, look at all these options here. Barbed wire death match. So you have your option for death matches. It could be a cage. If that's perhaps too pedestrian, a bit too tame, you can go for the barbed wires. And if that is not... If that's too tame, you can go for freaking landmines. You can also go for gruesome fighting, which I don't even know what that is. Let's start with a simple, normal match. Uh, oh my god, look at all these options. So Fire Pro Wrestling here is known for having a lot of options. Oh my god, we even get to pick our... Our referee, or can we? Yeah, okay, wait. So we, our referee can be Panther, Saga, Septiego, Amada, Dai, Taki, Mr. Fair, <laughs> Mr. Fair Joe, Ray. Oh my god, Ray has like the body of a dude. Look, the arms don't even change. She is built, man. She is built. Let's go with, uh, I like the idea of Mr. Fair. He's like this like uh, kindly old Japanese man. He's not even dressed in proper referee gear. He was just sort of like... A guy who happened to be passing on the street, and everyone kind of agreed at that moment that he seemed pretty fair and on the level. Okay, we're going to go ahead and select. Now we get to pick our wrestler, and we have... Boy, do we have a selection here. There's something like 377 wrestlers that you can select here. So, uh, I saw the word butt. Jumping knee butt. That's what this guy's move is, the jumping knee butt. Quite a move for a guy who just hangs around in a, in a red speedo there. Um, look at all these dudes. We can just sort of like, like I'm not gonna have time to like read all these guys. Ev evil windmill hole. Look, this guy has a uh, a death mask on. Okay, let's try and find the guy who looks the closest, like Hulk Hogan. And right now, Inizuka is our is our lead contender. My only oh god, <laughs> is that a guy or a girl? He's like dressed in a pink suit. Team is View Baby. Okay, this guy confuses me on multiple levels. But my only, my only decision to be made here... Oh, that guy hops around. It, oh, this guy's in full armor. Are you kidding? That's not fair. Uh, my, but my only decision factor is, does he look like Hulk Hogan? I will also accept Macho Man Randy Savage. They are both correct answers here. Oh, these guys are even taller. Look at this hornet. Wow, look at all these guys. Okay, so... Oh, okay. So it kind of ends around there. Let's go with this super tall guy. I kind of like that. The top cage fighter joins wrestling. Done. Done. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, can I go back here? Uh, hold on. There's, there's like, oh my god, there's like different arenas? Oh my god, look at all this! So if you hit left or right, you get, you get into like different modes of wrestlers. Look, you can get Panther. You can be fighting as a judge. I'm so confused here. Look at all these guys. How would you ever have the time to like learn all these wrestlers? Like, look at this, this is insane. Um, okay, we've kind of lost our dude. Uh, I think I'll just pick someone out of here who kind of looks like Hulk Hogan. 
Um, nothing like Hulk Hogan, and he's Japanese, but sure, we'll take it. And you can go ahead. Oh, and he can, like, wrestle in a suit. Nah, Hulk always was shirtless. And if he did have a shirt, he tore it off in a fit of rage before the game began. All right. Napoli versus Kijanaka. Napoli appeal, I guess I should say. So, the thing that I was excited about for this game is that despite the fact that this is a PS2 game, it is a sprite-based game. So all the wrestlers that you saw there that we were selecting, you might have noticed already, but they were not 3D rendered uh, polygons, they were sprites. And I'm excited about this. You know what, it's, it's one of those things where like, I have nothing against polygons, but the games I grew up with as a kid were all sprites. Everything I played as a kid was sprite-based. Like, look at this. This it looks like an old Capcom game. Um, and what, what's really interesting to me about this game is seeing a game that uses sprites but is modern. So back in the day, you know, the reason that games use sprites is because uh, game systems couldn't render things in 3D. So you'd have to cheat and draw it in two dimensions. And you draw a couple different poses and so on of that, uh, of that wrestler in two dimensions. But you'd be rather limited. So like if you were doing this where you're kind of like panning around 360, there'd maybe be the view of him front facing diagonally then side facing, you know. But this is like a modern sprite based game. So we get to see like some really polished, um, oh god, we get to see some really polished sprites here. Um, oh god, oh my god, oh we're arm wrestling. Yeah, beat him, beat him, beat him, beat him. Okay, I don't even know what any of the controls are. Oh, he's dominating me. Uh, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Pause. Oh no, there's only continue and quit match. <laughs> okay, we're gonna have to learn the, the keys on the fly here. Oh my god. So this is a game that does not reward button mashing. That's another big thing about the uh, Fire Pro Wrestling series games. Oh, but we got him in We got him in an arm hold. Oh yeah, and I threw myself on the ground. I don't know if that's a thing. Um, so this is a game that does not reward button mashing, and as we all know, you grab my butt there. Uh, as we all know, I am a button masher. That is how I get through through life. Oh, I did a reversal there. Oh, he kicked me in the butt. He's grabbing my butt. Oh, he's stomping my butt. This guy has a butt fetish. I think his his move was like the uh, the flying knee butt or something like that. Oh, yo! Oh, he threw me around. Okay, so as I'm playing here. Pretty much for this first match, just be impressed at the wrestling that is occurring and imagine I'm the guy who's winning. I'm gonna have to like go and look up the controls in a second here. Oh my god, what do I do? <laughs> oh god, nah, I, I'm totally button mashing. I think I figured circle is like a drop kick. Um, triangle runs and oh, I need to slap me right on my face. No, 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 get off me. Okay, what does square do? Square kind of punches. Uh, X kind of gives a kick, and, um, oh my god. I only ever got him once in those holds. So this game is very sort of strategic, and it is not a button masher. It is, it is made for people who really like wrestling. Oh! I, I like, bit him, bit him in the, bit him in the groin. Interesting move. Okay, I can't, I can't seem to land those, those kicks or anything. This game is, like, all about the, um... All about the holds, it seems. Mr. Fair! Mr. Fair, call this, man! That's not fair. Yeah! Every time. Every time. And then he just grabs me and sits on my butt. Get off of my butt! Get off of my butt! <laughs> I don't know how to get out of this. Okay, there we go. Um, so, yeah. So, you know, like, you can look at the sprites in this game. And what's interesting is that, yeah, everything is sprite-based. Oh, I'm, like, fleeing. I'm fleeing the fight. Oh, I remember this from, like, old Super Nintendo games. And you'd have, like, ten seconds to be out of the ring. Um, oh, I did, like, a, uh, I did, like, a power jump. I'm just jumping around the arena now. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, I think I knocked myself out. I'm out cold! I knocked myself out cold! Oh, man, and the butt sitting again. Um, but it's interesting to see a game that has sprites nowadays. Like, I'm just, I'm looking at the graphics for this game. And I, it, it's so much more interesting to me than if they had tried to make this polygonal. Oh, he kicked me in the butt. Oh, but I, I kicked him in the face. But I think my guy is, is out of steam, man. You can, only, you can only get hit in the butt so many times. Okay. Come on. Oh, finally a dropkick landed. Button match. I, I know that's not the way to do it. I know that's not the way that's going to win me in this game. Oh, my God. Kablamo! Can we get a calling on this ref? I, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much dead on my feet. 
I'm having I'm, I'm having trouble sort of retaining consciousness. Oh yeah! Oh look at this! Look at this! Oh what? Oh what? What? I didn't even know how how to do that. Hey oh oh we bumped into each other. Oh it was a reversal. Come on! Gah. Come on! You know, one thing I've always thought is a little, uh, a little obvious that wrestling is, uh, is obviously fake, because wrestling, ob I mean, obviously, it's, it's, you know, more of a performance art than, uh, a sport, per se, although it does take a lot of athleticism to perform wrestling, of course, uh, you know, as a kid, I never really appreciated that, but I think, <laughs> oddly enough, after watching Glow as an adult, I realized just how much of a sport it is, even though it is more of a performance and not a competitive sport in the sense of, uh, people aren't really fighting to see who wins. The matches are all kind of rigged. But one thing I always thought was a dead giveaway that was sort of quote-unquote fake is when one guy kind of like pushes the other guy towards the uh, the side of the ring with all the elastic bands, and the one guy just goes off running. It's like, what, did he lose free will? It's like if somebody kind of pushes me, I don't immediately start running and then bounce off the ropes and start running back to him into his clothesline. I'm like, oh, I'm out of control. It's like, no, you have the power to stop. So it's like that always seemed a little uh, a little fake. Anyway, we got our butt handed to us. Napoli was definitely not the Hulk Hogan I was hoping he would be. Look at all these game modes we have to try out. So hold on, there is... Okay, so all of these are just basically tournaments, leagues, matches, battle royale. Is the battle royale like, um... Oh my god, is this, is this just like a whole bunch of guys fighting? Uh, let's go all the way down to next. Oh my god, we can... Oh my god, what? what is this? We can just set up uh, a bunch of... Oh my god. Hold on. Okay, set this, 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 this. <laughs> should I be in here? I should totally be in the mix. Okay, hold on. I, I need to go and I'll be this dude. I'll be Olive, the, uh, the gentle giant. And, okay, hold on, I'm going to cut really quickly and check the controls here. Okay, I just read a little crash course in what to do here. So it turns out square is the weak attack, X is the medium attack, and circle is the strong attack. And if you walk up to an opponent, you will automatically come into, uh, you know, come into a, a connection. You'll grab each other. And then when you sort of, your hands meet and there's a smack sound effect, the first person to press a direction and hit an attack will initiate, will win the attack. But if you mash the buttons, which is intuitive, uh, it is intuitive, but it will cause you to lose the interaction. So I've got to overcome, I've got to overcome my tendency to button mash, and I've got to, oh man, oh, are we on a team? This is totally, this is totally rad. Radical, dude. I feel like I'm, uh, I feel like I'm in the 80s, at like uh, my in my friend's house in the basement after school and we're like playing a wrestling game oh my god which one am i okay i'm in the i'm the guy in the, the top corner i'm i'm staying out of the entire battle yeah good good one guys everyone go fight each other okay let's see if we can initiate a hold here they're just oh i just rolled a guy out of the way oh and i lost i lost a thing oh man there's so much there's so much chaos going on here that uh I guess, I guess it doesn't really matter if you can see what I'm doing, because at least you're going to see a lot. Oh, a guy grabbed me from behind and it hurt me. Um, but I guess the nice thing is that uh, at least if I do poorly, um, you can see a lot of other stuff happening. Oh, oh, somebody's pitting me. Get off of me. This is madness, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, I threw that guy into the ropes. Oh, and he, he ran into me. I don't even know what's going on, man. This is crazy. Um, oh, my God. So I, by the way, was, like, never super into wrestling, like, as a kid. Like, th there were kids in my class who, like, had the wrestling play sets and stuff like that. And uh, I, I was just never that kid. I, w I was never the one who was, like, you know, like, I thought Hulk Hogan was kind of kind of interesting. But, like, I, I, I was never super into him. As I said, I always kind of thought wrestling was a little fake. I mean, it, again, it is. It is fake in the sense of, you know, these aren't guys... These are guys who are playing characters. The characters are not real. And that is sort of what's fake about wrestling. Uh, but again, you know, as as I become older, I don't even know where I am right now. Did I just get in the, Oh, I'm at the bottom. Everyone's like fighting on top of me. I got kicked out of the ring. Uh, but as, as I've gotten older, I've appreciated the athleticism more in wrestling. But uh, yeah, 
It was never it was never a wrestler. I remember kids had like the like wrestling arenas when we were kids. Uh, like little action figures of Hulk Hogan and Macho Man Randy Savage and yeah, and Jake the Snake and The Undertaker. I'm trying to think of like all the wrestler names that I know. And uh, and I remember oh oh I'm choking a guy out. I remember you know playing with the wrestling action figures as a kid. Um, just because that's kind of like what you did as a kid is you uh, you played with wrestling action figures. Uh, if somebody invited you over to their house, it was impolite to refuse uh, a little action sesh. Um, oh, we're doing a double team! Yeah! Oh, I just hurt myself. Yeah! Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna try and like blind slide slide people here. I'm told. Oh, I did I did that move. Oh, I threw somebody out of the ring. This is always an awesome thing you can do. Oh! <laughs> okay, I'm stupid. I set the rules to when you exit the ring, you lose. And I'm like, oh, I threw someone out of the ring. I was going to hop out of the ring and keep him out of the ring till he got a disqualification. But by leaving the ring, I just disqualified myself. So now we'll watch these four wrestlers uh, finish it off. But yeah, that, that's a fun thing that you can do. You can probably do it in this wrestling game, and I remember doing it in, like, Nintendo ones and stuff, too, where if you... Oh, what is happening? <laughs> he just had his head between his legs for a while. Now he's taking a breather. He's like, oh, God, I can't believe my head is between that guy's legs. Uh, but I always remember that was sort of a cheap way to win in wrestling, is knock the other guy out of the arena, wait, uh, wait until it got to, like, nine seconds, uh, until the ref would count up to nine, because ten seconds out of the arena and you're disqualified. Then you knock the guy down one more time, then you get back in the arena, and uh, then he totally loses. And uh, that's how you do it. Um, so I don't even know who's on... Oh! <laughs> who's on whose team? I guess Gray Pants and Green Pants are on the same team, because they both double-teamed Blue Pants. But, oh my god, that looks like it would hurt. Uh, you know, wrestling might be sort of fake, but the, some of the moves look like they would really, really... Hurt, you know. Oh, he's got he's, he's clearly grabbing him by the groin. That's that's called the Michael Jackson pin. It's uh, illegal on uh, opposing wrestlers under the age of 18. <laughs> you must be 18 years or older to be pinned by this method. Um, oh, he knocked the ref over. <laughs> what? What? The ref is crying. Isn't that like an automatic disqualification? Oh my god. Yeah, I don't know who's gonna win. Oh, the ref is like the ref is like out of it, man. Oh, that guy's like raging. Oh yeah, you can do um, you can do like taunts and stuff. We totally have to like do a taunt the next time we're actually allowed to play this game. Uh, this reminds me of those sports games that like you can set two computer teams to play against one another and then you can just sit back and watch. I've always wondered if anyone ever does that. Like, like were there guys who owned like you know NHL hockey or whatever, or even I think Blades of Steel, you can do it potentially. I don't 100% remember if you can there, but like games as simple as Blades of Steel or, or some early NES baseball games, you could set two computer teams to be the two teams and just let them fight. And I've always wondered, like, did anyone ever do that? Like, was anyone ever home on a Saturday and they're like, oh man, like I'm, I'm just too wiped to actually play uh, Blades of Steel, but I would love to just watch a match. So I'm like going to grab a beer, set two computer opponents and just like chill and like see who wins. Or like maybe it was like, Someone who's, like, a big, like, hockey fan or whatever, and, um, you know, like, the playoffs had ended or whatever, and they're like, oh, I need, like, a hockey fix, you know? And, like, back in the day, there wasn't, you know, YouTube and Twitch and stuff. There wasn't, like, you couldn't just access, you know, sports games whenever you want. And uh, so maybe people were like, you know what, I'll just watch a couple, uh, watch watch some computerized teams go at it in uh, Blades of Steel, and that's how, that's how I'll get, uh, get my rocks off. I don't know. Um, okay, are these guys ever gonna win or what? Like, they're... <laughs> and who's on whose team? I... Oh, oh, he's phasing out of time and reality! Did you guys see that? He, uh, he was sort of phasing out of existence there. Um, I thought that these guys were on a team because they were, like, teaming up to do moves against Blue Pants here, but, like, it seems like this is just a free-for-all at this point. It seems like everyone's fighting everyone. They're like, we've, we've fought this war so long, we forgot that there was an alliance. Oh, now Blue and Green Pants are teamed up. Oh, and they got Gray Pants out of the arena. I thought this was going to go on forever. 
Okay, so we're actually gonna get a winner here. I was about, I was literally a second away from quitting the match. Oh, that looks like it would hurt. Um, but now I actually wanna see who's gonna win. So what do, what do we think, guys? I think Blue's winning. Oh my God, 2.9, 2.999 repeating, in fact, which uh, technically rounds up to one in most uh, mathematical, um, uh, you know, systems. So that's technically three, but whatever. Oh, 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 all right. Oh, here he's going, yeah. I feel like I'm inclined to let these guys fight it out because there's no way I'm gonna be able to pull off moves this complicated um, today. All I wanna do is win a couple of these grapples. And I, I kinda like understand in theory how to do it, but anything that's based off of timing uh, and precision, I feel like always takes a lot of effort when you're totally new at it. So, you know, today we're just messing around with this game. You'll get to see me do some, some cool wrestling moves potentially, but uh, there's no way that we're going to, uh, there's no way that we're actually going to be good at this game. Now that I've seen what it takes. Um, it is interesting, by the way, so this game was released in Japan two years before North America, and then eventually Italy, Spain, and Portugal, you know, the rest of the world. Uh, boom, he wins! Blue Pants won! Did it? He made a comeback. Everyone's a loser except Ryuji Nito. Um, I was just going to comment and say, you know, you can totally tell this game did come from Japan because, like, every wrestler is Japanese. I said I wanted to be the wrestler most similar to Hulk Hogan. I can't find, like, a single guy who's, like, even mildly similar. Um, okay, I was Shiba and I was a ring out loss. That, and that should say, not ring out loss, that should say voluntary disqualification. I just, you know, if we're going to be correct about this, uh, I can do an endless. What does that mean? Uh, normal. Okay, we've seen the Battle Royale, which is totally awesome. Uh, team match, league. All right, back to an exhibition match. So we got a few things. So we want to try gruesome fighting, landmine, and barbed wire. Why not? Uh, I don't know what SWA rules is. Let's start with a gruesome fight. How about this? Rule give up. Okay, whatever. Uh, let's go with a different ref this time. Cindy, let's go with Ray. All right, Ray, Ray will count us down. Critical, is there, actually, is there like an easy? Can we set this to easy? Blue, rounds, five, ring, computer skill, one. I hope that doesn't mean, I hope one isn't very good. Oh God, the computer skill was four. So does that mean that 10 is good or one is good? This is so ambiguous. Okay, we're either gonna fight an amazing computer or a terrible computer. And beyond that, BGM. Let's just go for it. Um, okay, let's find somebody who looks cool. We're going purely on looks here. That guy looks like an MMA fighter. Um, ooh, this guy. This guy's got a bit of a dance to him. Yeah, he's he's also a pretty boy. Created an original style of fighting. Uh, you know what? I'll take it. Mataki. And no, no, no. He needs the highlights, man. You know what? He's he's all razzle dazzle. He's got to dazzle the opponents with his like uh, fire mix of baby hair, and then he's got to razzle him with a with a boot to the face, the flying knee hold, right to the old groin area. Um, and he's gonna be fighting against. Uh, we just saw that guy fight. Oh my god, this guy also has a razzle dazzle to him. Uh, no, we need we need like the opposite of. Ra oh my god, look at the thing this guy's wearing. The Death Valley bomb. Huh, we need the opposite of Razzle Dazzle. And these guys are more Razzle than my Dazzle ever was. So it can't be any of these guys. Okay, how about A Pit? Oh, you know, we should fight that baby guy. Where was he? I don't even know. Okay, hold on. BBT. Oh, how about this guy? Oh, the Shining Wizard. All right. Uh, oh, oh, yeah, okay. Totally. We're going to fight a big fat guy in pink underwear, <laughs> in a pink Speedo. Profile the fake king, the orgy president. All right, done. We're doing it. Ryutu versus Mr. Mimic. He's like, aha, I will mimic you. I am a shapeshifter. Only my body is incredibly obese, so that tends to give it away. All right, and I forget, did we pick a cage fight? Oh, we picked gruesome fighting. Oh, this is gonna be like MMA, man. Slap. Oh yeah. You want some of this, buddy? Oh, you don't slap me. I kick you in the face. I kick you, kick you in the... <laughs> okay, I feel like he's not 
super good. Oh, yeah, there we go. And, okay. Oh, there we go. I'm going to try this again. Okay. Up and, up and attack. Yes! Okay, cool. So when the computer's not very good, I can win these. And, yeah, so you just sort of press a direction and an attack. And, oh. And you, and you really got to wait for it. My instinct is as soon as we grapple to, like, uh, to, like, press it, but... You really gotta wait until like you've uh, until you've kind of locked hands. Like that's the secret. And I might not even be pressing it at the right time, uh, but the computer is on low difficulty, I believe. So it's like giving me a lot of leeway to like do this shoot. Okay. Oh, and you can't you can't run. There are no ropes to bounce off of. Oh, you jab me in the back. Can we get a calling on that? Like if you go to run, you just like run into the cage. He's like, oh, let me out of here! Let me out of here! There's a big fat guy in pink underwear! Oh, God! <laughs> All right. It's enough being silly. Let's get this guy. Oh, man. Oh, my God. You know, I have a feeling I, I still may lose. Even though the computer's on the simplest difficulty, I might still lose. But uh, that's okay, because we're having fun. Ow. Oh. Oh, what? I'm dead? What? What the hell was that? I, I don't even understand what happened there. Round two? Oh, is this timed or something? Okay. Oh my god, he got me. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> okay. Interesting. So what's interesting too is if you look at the people in the background, by the way, like they're not quite the same sprites as all the wrestlers. The wrestlers have very like vibrant colors. Ow. Oh. And uh, the people in the background are all like much more plain looking color wise. Ugh. Oh my god. Okay. Grab him and throw him. Oh. Oh, get, get him. <laughs> Damn, we were doing good for like uh, the first round there. But this guy's, this guy's totally got me now. He's got my number. Gublamo! Oh yeah. We're gonna slap you around, buddy. Oh. God. My guy's like on the ground, like panting. He's like doing that thing, like in Street Fighter, when you beat up too much. He's like, ooh, 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 and like the stars around him, like Roger Rabbit, essentially. Oh, look, he's got his little dance on. Ooh, ah. Can't hit what you can't catch, fat boy. Kablam! We'll like go ahead and slap him. Oh my god, he's doing the same to us. I feel like half the wrestling moves that we do just ends up with us both on the ground. How about this? How about this? How about this? Oh, I think I got him. Oh, no. Oh, he's going to spit on me. <laughs> okay. We just ended up curled up in a ball there. Um, okay, here we go. All right, take your bets, people. Oh, my God. I can't believe that, that spinning kick misses every time. I don't mind that the game is mostly grapples, but I wish, like, these attacks did something. Oh, did I hit him or did he, like, just lean back out of it? Okay, how about this? Oh! <laughs> oh, what? Am I knocked out? <laughs> what happened? No! Don't pin me! Don't pin me! I'm not giving up! I'm not giving up! The ref just came over to wave at me. Okay, now we're gonna do, uh... Oh, yeah, there we go. Do you want more? Check out my hair, everybody! This guy's a loser! Ha 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 ha! everyone's chanting for me! Oh! <laughs> and I ran into a fence! And, okay, I lost, I lost the chance. Oh, but we, we hit him. Oh, we're tangling him up. Oh, ow, jeez, elbow to the hip, not cool, buddy. Okay, I, I wish I'd taken advantage when the, the crowd was all cheering for me. Maybe we can get it to happen again. Yeah, everybody clap, everybody clap. Yes, no, 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 he's got me, he's got me. Everyone keep jack clapping. Ah. Oh my god, alright, we, we're totally losing this fight, aren't we? I can read the writing on the wall. I I don't know who would pay to see this fight. It, it might just be me, but it doesn't seem... <laughs> this seems like a couple of uh, a couple of big guys, oh my god, constantly sort of falling on top of each other. Maybe you like seeing muscly, potbelly dudes flailing around on top of each other. But, uh, oh my god. Okay, go, 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 go! Yeah! What? I thought I had him! Oh! <laughs> I think my guy's dead. I think, I think I'm out. Like, look, he's not even breathing anymore. 
He's he's not he's not only unconscious, he's like dead. Alright, well we lost again. Okay, so gruesome fighting is just MMA. Okay, uh, let's actually just try one more. Let's try Landmine Deathmatch and just see what that's all about here. Um, okay, then we have like an infinite stream of options, which we're again going to skip. Let's see, calm skill. Let's, let's knock this all the way up. Let's make it interesting. Uh, what's lumber? Tornado, the rope can be on or off. I want, I want the rope to be on. The rope is fun. Critical, medium, all right. And I will be, ooh, wait, this guy. Oh man, we're being, we're being the giant. We're being uh, baby giant. Look, this is like the most ridiculous outfit ever. This one actually looks a little more normal. This one looks totally normal. This one looks kind of cool, actually. Why would this be his default look? Physically blessed and a future champ. This is like the Andre the Giant of uh, wrestling, I guess. Okay, I don't know what's going on with that guy. He has odd taste in fashion. All right, we gotta end on somebody totally rad. We want like the most craziest opponent that we can possibly find here. Uh, now apparently this game has like 397 wrestlers. Oh, this guy looks like a bad guy from an 80s movie. We're totally taking this. Um, and we can just change the color of his underwear. Do you want him to have black underwear with gloves? No gloves. Gray underwear or blue underwear with gloves? And I guess the black with gloves makes the most sense. <laughs> Oh man, my guy looks really weird. And I'm going up against like an 80s villain. Um, this is good, Bullhorn Lewis. He will basically be the sort of like main villain to my like, you know, Mighty Ducks wrestling movie here. My guy came up from the streets, everyone kind of made fun of him. Um, but like he, you know, damn it, he's going to, oh my God, this guy is not, oh, what, I just exploded. What the hell was that? <laughs> okay. I uh, forgot we turned landmines on. My bad. This is this is like a movie. Oh, he's dominating me. He's dominating the gentle baby. Yeah, okay. I just want to get a single hit on him. I've been exploded. Oh my god, this guy is unrelenting. Oh, he's, he's got me pinned. Jesus. All right, well, hopefully... Uh, Oh my god, hopefully this is kind of interesting for you guys to watch. Oh my god, there's landmines everywhere. Oh my god, he's gonna punch me into one. My only hope is like I can somehow throw him into a landmine. Oh, come on, buddy. Yes, yes! Oh, come on, that, what? Oh, I think, is he bleeding on his face? Was that barbed wire? I think it was, my god, this thing is like intense. Okay, here we go, reverse it, reverse it, no! Baby! Jeez. Oh my god. Anyway, as I was saying, there's like 397 wrestlers in this game, but there's actually room for 500, and you can like customize and make your own wrestler. Maybe actually we should try and do that, because I think we're about to lose. We literally just lost. Oh my god, that didn't take any time at all. Bullhorn Lewis. Maybe this isn't the end of the movie. This is like the very beginning of the movie where our intrepid hero gets his butt kicked. By, like the evil villain and then he has to spend like two hours training and like realizing his own self-worth in order to like come back and win okay very quickly let's get out of this uh sure go ahead and save my data you know what knock yourself out memory card one now has a save game for fire pro wrestling i wonder if psycho mantis and metal gear solid could read the uh save game for this you know, remember that in, in uh, Metal Gear Solid, the first one for PlayStation 2, Psycho Mantis would break the fourth wall and he would talk to you about the save games you have on your memory card. Imagine he could read Fire Pro Wrestling, like of all the games. He's like, yeah, and I see that you uh, lost as the big baby wrestler in Fire Pro Wrestling. Edit ring, edit logo, edit team. Let's uh, create a new... They're retired wrestlers? There are legends? Um, Carlos Clauser. Interesting. We can edit his appearance. Let's edit this appearance. Oh my god. Oh, uh, there's all these things that are locked. I was totally gonna say we're gonna make a Hulk Hogan. Wait, 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 hold on though. Can we can we make a new wrestler? Oh my god, look, I'm just scrolling down to see if at the bottom it's like new is an option. Look at all these wrestlers. Oh my god. 
Um, I haven't been able to figure out how to make a new wrestler. I've been I've been bouncing around the menus. It's a little disappointing, actually. Man, I just I, I want to see a Hulk, the fine dunk. Nope. Okay, so there is a way to make a new wrestler somehow. I don't fully understand how though. You can you can make a referee though if you want. Um, anyway, uh, no, don't don't save any of that. All right, let's uh, let's let's wrap this up on a fun type of match. Okay, we've seen most of these S to one rules match, SWA. Let's go ahead and just try a normal match, and we're gonna set the computer to one. And the venue is the number one ring, West Dome, the Dojo, the USA Dome. Done. Mr. Fair. I didn't like Mr. Fair. I feel like he was a little biased. We're going to go with Amada. Rope on. Lumber off. Sure. DQ count on. <gasps> okay. That all sounds good. Okay. And we're going to be this guy I found called Borgat. Borgart. Just because that is an awesome name. And Borgart likes to wrestle as nude as he can get. Actually, he likes to have a bit of flair on his undies too, though. So that will be him. We're going up against... Oh, look at this dude. Look at this douche, I should say. The prince. We're totally taking on him. Teams up with good-looking wrestlers. Yeah, I bet he does. Oh, my God. We can make him wrestle in pink. I don't know why it's funny to have, like, dude wrestlers in pink, but it just kind of is. So we're totally doing it. All right, now we're the evil 80s villain. Look at this, how the tables have turned. We're Gigant Bog Bogart versus the third Rombard, the prince. He's the good guy. We're the bad guy. Maybe we're both bad guys. Do bad guys ever fight each other, like in these like '80s movies? It's like bad guy on bad guy, maybe. A 30-minute one match. He has such a weird stance. All right, here we go. Everyone cheer for me! Come on! Boom! Oh, oh, oh! Yeah, body blow, buddy. And we hit you on the head too. Wait, you want more? Oh, he hit me on the neck. Okay. <laughs> oh, he's choking me out. He has something written on his butt. Did you see that? Oh, my God. Okay. Yeah! Yes! We got we to use our, our insane bear strength. Hold on. We also... Oh, God. Get away from me. I want to do, like, a cheer so I get the audience on my side. Stop joking me, buddy. Okay. He's throwing me into the ropes and squishing my head in his groin. Okay, here we go. Yes! 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 All right. Go! Oh, we threw him out of the ring, too. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh, I wanted to do that ring out strategy. It would have been so cool. Okay, I don't know how to get back in the ring now. I might have screwed myself. Oh, no. How do, how do I get back in? <laughs> how do I get in? What the heck? Um. Oh, I spun around a pole. Did you see that? Still can't find a way to get in. Okay, there we go. All right. I thought I just, like, lost the match. Okay, here we go. Oh, the friendship. I call this one the friendship bracelet. Oh, bam. And I call that one, don't, don't leave me out of, uh, don't leave me out of your weekend plans. I thought we were friends. Yes. There we go. Now we're kicking some butts. Kaboom. Oh, 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 come on. He countered me. Um, anyway, I should probably start wrapping my thoughts up on this game here. This could go on for a little while. So, uh, Fire Pro Wrestling Returns, um, I will say is actually like a super interesting game for the PlayStation 2. I think I was hoping for it to be a little more sort of approachable for newbies in terms of its controls. So, um, I think I'd take a, f a few points away for... Uh, for the casual player for complexity. But if you are a wrestling fan, then you might actually appreciate the uh, complexity here. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. So this is one of the games of the book, A Thousand One Video Games You Must Play Before You Die. Um, there's things I like about it, like the fact that it is a modern sprites game. That is actually totally awesome. Um, it's a very neat idea for a game. I'd like, I wish there were more games that were kind of like this. I mean, I guess there are. You know, like uh, Gunstar Superheroes and stuff like that, or, or sprite-based games that are modern. Um, but I can't think of, like, I saw a screenshot of this game, and it totally looked like the wrestling games that I grew up with on Super Nintendo and Nintendo. So it's like, that's what excited me about it. It was a PlayStation 2 game that looked like an old NES game. 
I wish there were more modern games like that. Um, you know, it, it's it's not pixel art, you know, because I know that pixel art has kind of made a comeback in, in recent years and so on. You can get lots of indie games that are pixel arty, but, like, this is a little different. It's... Oh, man, that was a brutal move. It's not quite pixel arty, but it's retro enough. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. So, at the end of the day, I love the art. I love the idea behind this game. I think the controls are doable, um, but I think it's... You know, it's supposed to be all about strategy and stuff, but it just seems to me you got to be good at, like, winning those grapples. And if you're good at your timing for winning the grapples, then... I, I mean, I guess I'm sure there's strategy if you figure this game out, but it just seems like uh, not a button masher, but it's not necessarily that much different from a button masher. It's just you got to get your timings right, if that makes sense. I don't know. So at the end of the day, you know, not being a wrestling fan, um, I find this game very interesting. I don't think it's a bad game. I don't know if I would say it's a must-play, in my opinion. Like, this one this one hasn't converted me. I haven't been like, whoa, like, this is like a really good wrestling game that I would want to come back and play. It's kind of a cool game, but I don't know if I would continue playing this kind of in my own spare time. So, like, that's that's sort of the metric I'm going with here. Even though I'm, like, dominating this guy. Oh, my God. He's not going to... His liver is just going to be totally destroyed after this match. Oh, there we go. Let's choke him out. Ah, choke him with his own pretty hair. So yeah, that's my opinion. It's an interesting game. Um, if you like wrestling games, especially if you like strategy in your wrestling games, you might be interested in this series. The art is amazing. There's tons of options here. Like, by all intents and purposes, it is a cool wrestling game with a lot going on for it. But at the same time, not being a wrestling gamer myself, I don't think it's a must-play. Nothing about it sort of strikes me as, like, if you didn't really like wrestling games, just like video games generally, you have to play this before you die. Um, so yeah. So those are my thoughts. What do you guys think? Do you agree with me? Do you disagree? Do you have thoughts or opinions of your own? Feel free to share those in the comments down below. As always, I like to hear from you guys. And, uh, as always, whatever... Oh, I'm like... Oh! I thought I was gonna hit him right in the head. Um, you know, whatever you guys think of the game, hopefully I have made today entertaining for you. If, uh, if I have, go ahead, slap that like button, subscribe to the channel. You guys know the drill. Uh, and if you don't, Bogart here is going to come for you, for you and your children. And he might even have the prince with him. Uh, it looks like he's giving me a stretch before an exercise. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Um, and uh, I guess we should hang out here until we see who wins. Although I think it's going to clearly be me. So uh, maybe we can just like fast forward this a little bit here. Oh my god, like having a heart attack. <laughs> oh my god, look at him. Oh my god, am I gonna lose? Oh my god. My guy's too old. He He's too old for this! Are you kidding me? I just lost! Bogart, no! You lost to a pretty boy. Oh my god, schoolboy. What does that even mean? Alright, even on the easiest difficulty, even with a bit of practice, still can't win. Oh well. It was one hell of a ride though, wasn't it guys? All right, guys, you all take care of yourselves. We'll see you soon. Peace. I'm getting too old for this shit.